this is strange. One of our servers is being pinged constantly from the Wi-Fi of a particular Star Roger coffee. How is that relevant? Yes, I thought it was noise at first too, but then I decoded the pings. It's Morse code. Three letters repeating over and over. Go on. S. O. Wait for it. S. Bears further scrutiny, I'd say. Send the coordinates to my optic. Okay, uh, so we're going to start this mission now. How far away is it? I am not in any way driving that far with no rewards. I mean, it's right here from the station, so it's a real win win situation, actually. Okay, um, jump over that, and there we go. How much you want to bet? Uh, I'll beat your ass. I'm here. What's next? There doesn't seem to be any obvious peril, does there? Have a seat and I'll ping back the IP, sending us the distress signal. Mm -hmm. I'm sure we will. Okay. I think it's the first time we've sat down in the game, actually, besides in a car. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> Flip phone? Am I meant to find this amusing? It's a cryptophone. It's secure. Every device on CTOS can be compromised. If we're overheard, we're dead. Both of us. Who the hell is this? Not important. What matters is that I have inside information on SIRS, and I believe the people who framed you are rogue officers. And loath as I am to say it, dead sec may be my only hope to stop them. We'll hear you out, but I'm not making any promises. Good. I hit coordinates to a meeting place on a device in that establishment. Ouch. It got burned. It is burned. Okay, Sabine, what do you make of all this? All right, that's a wrinkle. So this SARS bloke says Zero Day are a bunch of Secret Service dickheads. I mean, I suppose it does make sense. The bombings were too sophisticated for randos, but SARS could pull it off. Officially, SIRS, or the Signals Intelligence Response Service, uses surveillance data drawn from CTOS to identify large scale terrorist and criminal threats. Then they send Albion to shoot the threats in the face, for example. And in the wake of escalating violence in London, the SIRS is extending the right to use lethal force to law enforcement and Albion securities. Unofficially, SIRS uses your data to read your mind and arrest you for having naughty thoughts. So we have means and opportunity, which leaves motive. SARS are fascist pricks, but they're supposed to stop groups like Zero Day from doing terrorist shite. Why cause one? When you meet this guy, ask. Definitely. Should I, uh... Go for, uh... What the hell are these two doing? Okay. We have a complication. He's not here and evidence suggests, well, violence. SIRS might be onto him. If you get access to the area's surveillance infrastructure, I can rebuild the scene in AR. I'll get it done. Well, that's a, that's a camera right there. Switch out the camera. What the hell is this? Why are we talking to him? Hello. What are you doing here? I ain't seen nothing, Gov. What do you mean? Wait. You don't... Ah, oh, bollocks. You're undercover, aren't you? Trying to see if I'll talk, eh? Ain't gonna happen. Please calm down. I ain't seen nothing. Hmm. Well, he refused to talk. Oh no. We have to deal with these things now. Well, good thing I have drone hacking abilities, right? Um. There we go. 
That's done. That's done. Done. There we go. That was easy enough. I guess. He's gonna die, you know? Watch him die. And he'll die a slow, painful death being a hobo goblin. That's done it. Now return to the scene and I'll reconstruct what happened to our contact. Here we are. I see the fight. Ooh, I just noticed the blood. That appears to be our contact. Ooh. They shot him dead. Jesus Christ. Yes, it certainly doesn't look like his best day, does it? Analyze the clues in the AR workspace to find out what happened to him. Uh yeah. This is a non-lethal weapon, so odds are he's still alive, though he may not want to be. Um We need the plates of this van though. It might not actually have plates, I just realized. They've taken our SIRS contact away, but they may still be nearby. I can reconstruct the vehicle's path from unsecured CCTV recordings. That should allow you to follow it. Okay. So let me follow it then. Okay. It's on this side. I definitely didn't expect that. And then it went this side. The marker helped me there. It went this side. Ouch! Damn taxi. Look at how these guys are turning. They know how to the drive. The construction's them. nearly finished, and so's our contact. If you don't hurry. Okay. Wait. Why the hell? Oh. Ouch. It took a last minute turn. That's not fair. And in the wrong direction too. Shut up. What would you say to me? I can I can I can uh, you me to do exactly? It looks like our contact's assailants stopped here, but I can't see them nearby. Let's analyze the data to see if we can find out where they went. Okay. CTOS AR data reconstruction in progress. Really? They put him in another van. Our contact's assailants are switching vehicles to elude pursuers, which is standard operating procedure for private military perks like Albion. Albion? I thought they'd be sirs. What can I tell you? They're mercenaries. If you keep looking, you might find out why they're interested in an SRS whistleblower. Analyze this. I've completed a thorough analysis of the vehicle and concluded it is a van. That is true. But would you care to expand on your findings? Well, I could also mention that the minute traces of sand in the tire tracks indicate that it's been on a construction site recently. But you know me, hate to sound like a smart ass. I've been scanning nearby construction yards for Albion activity and, long story short, some dozy git has forgotten to turn off the security camera in the makeshift torture room. Show me. <coughs> Ooh, damn. I'm not who you think I am. This is what... You're Manning, a SERS officer and a leaky fucking twat. That's, that's not me. I swear to God, please, please. If he dies and we don't find out what he knows, I won't sleep properly for a year. Bagley, I need a location. Well, we're already at the location, so no worries. Okay, um, just gonna use the cameras a wee bit. Come on, come on, come on. Like, really? He didn't want to check at all. Hijack this. 
The door's on the other side. I don't know what I just disabled, but better be good. Mm. I am in trouble big, big, big time. Wait, the thing is up top. Wait, how far up is he? No, I so said down below this. Come on. There we go, he's dead. Um, how are you locking down a drone when you didn't even have your phone out? Okay. Have this. <clears throat> he did. Ay, ay, ay. Um, I'm this. I tracked him. I got this dude. Ah. There we go. He's down. She's down too. Ow. That's uh that's 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 not very nice. That's a GBB drone. Oh shit. I wasn't supposed to do that. Okay there we go. Uh hide behind this. There we go. Okay, hopefully no one else comes here or sees me. What is this? Another news room? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Shut up. This man just couldn't go to the trap, could he? Cause there should be a code somewhere. There's the camera that Bagley saw. Download this. Oh damn. But I still need to... I still need to... Uh, get rid of the guards. Like, what the hell is this? That's not fair. Oh. What are you trying to disrupt me for? Look at this. Oh, you did. Come on, sit on it. Sit on it. No. That glitch just is just so stupid. Okay, there's one more weirdo. Uh, but he's all the way down there. Um. There we go. Come on, come on, again. Okay. Ow! I don't like it. Start a lockdown. Come on, come on, come on. Don't do that, don't do that. Oh come on, they can't see me. Can they? Maybe they can. Who's to say? Uh hijack this one weirdo. Um she she, act, she she's refused to come down the side, doesn't she? <clears throat> she's just doing uh, squats or something. What the hell is she doing? Come this way, come this way. Really? I think she's just bugged out. Yeah, she definitely bugged out. Ouch. Okay. Um, recall the drone. And now it's time to go. And release this man. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Move, 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 move. Ah. Open sesame. 
I hope it's uh, Aiden, right? He was supposed to turn up in this game. It's okay, it's okay. I'm with dead sack. You called us? Of course. You shouldn't have come here. Now they'll know for sure I've betrayed them. Didn't we just save your life? No, you've just damned us both. Look, um, I'll upload the intelligence onto an anonymous FTP. It'll explain everything. Actually, I'd rather you explain everything. My name is Richard Malik. I'm an intelligence analyst. I believe Zero Day are rogue SIRS officers who framed you for the bombings to seize power. Uh -oh. Now they're murdering or blackmailing anyone who threatens them, which now somehow includes me. Interesting. I'll see what Bagley makes of it. I better not regret this. That I can't promise. Okay, buddy. Malik has made his way out, and now I suggest you do the same. Okay, if you say so. I mean, I don't have to do it. What the hell is all that noise? That's creepy. Too many variables here. We should check his intel before we make a decision. All right, one second. Bagley, check out his intel and call a meet, yeah? We'll sort this out together. Mm hmm. Okay, let's go see the where the meeting is and who's this? Prefers pet bullets to bug spray. Okay. Um, where are we supposed to go? Here? Wait, what's the mission? I actually have to wait for the missions to update. Ouch. Nah, man's bookie as fuck. Let's walk away from this one, fam. Come on. No way. He needs our help. May I present the third option? Just use him. An SIRS whistleblower, even one you don't trust, could still help us find the arseholes that blew up half of London and framed DedSec for it. You don't have to invite him to your birthday, just use his information. Good call, sweetie. Ah, uh, sure, whatever. Okay, so where are we supposed to go? Oh, we're supposed to go to the meeting. So I'll fast travel there. I swear to God, whoever keeps using my money to buy clothes, I am going to beat them one day. Like, like genuinely, this is one of these guys in here just keeps spending on clothes. Who's here? Not everyone's here. But okay. Shop. Hmm. Masks. He look at this one. Um. I'll just equip that for her. In the wear. Ah, uh, default is something boring. Of course it is. Ah, uh, leg wear. Anything new? Those weird things that someone bought. Oh boy, she is uh, naked. She was not supposed to be naked. Um, bags. This weird thing. Shoes. I think she. Oh, that, those, those aren't bad. No. I wanted to get outwear. No. Seven thousand. I need seven thousand more. Okay. I mean one thousand more. Never mind. I'm here. Are you ready to begin? Here's the gist. Malik's intelligence checks out. A rogue faction of SRS officers framed DedSec for the bombings to consolidate power over the government. But now they've noticed that some people are standing up to the new order, and they're blaming you. I believe these are the people you call Zero Day. I don't know their names, but it's safe to assume they have a ringleader. And in my experience overseas, removing the leader... Obviously! We take out the ringleader and we stop Zero Day. But why come to us now? Two weeks ago, a shell company connected with Zero Day's operations imported 40 kilos of Semtex from an old Soviet block depot. 
but it never left London. Which means Zero Day is planning a bombing that will make those earlier bombings look like a bonfire. And I think I know why. As we're all now painfully aware, false flag attacks are a common propaganda tool for despots. Kill a load of people and the rest fall into line behind whoever says they won't let it happen again. In this case, Zero Day. Which means we both want to discover who's pulling Zero Day strings and stop them. We need to get hold of the personnel dossiers of anyone connected with the earlier bombings and their cover-up. Then Malachi can analyze their common connections and work out who's in charge of Zero Day. And I'll be on the comm to observe. What's this? So if Malik's right, Zero Day are some kind of shadowy cabal of spies who blew up half the city to secretly take control of the government. But now they're pissed off that someone's standing up to them, so they're going to do it again. That's awful. I agree. You'd think they'd come up with something besides another bombing. Bit of a double beat, isn't it? It's possible that Zero Day is escalating because Dead Sec has become active again. Cut that victim flaming shit. I'd rather get blown up a thousand times than lie down just so some wannabe tyrants can stamp on my face. Well, uh, I guess that's true. Anyways, um, see you guys next time. Bye. Siku wate baby na kuwaza Mana kwako baby ni shadanza Kure